Hey kids, welcome to my YouTube channel Startup e-learning. In today's video, we will learn multiplication of a 3-digit number by a 2-digit number. This multiplication is also known as long multiplication. Kids, let's solve an example together. Multiply 316 by 28. And now, let's arrange these numbers according to its places. So, 6 will be written under 1's place, 1 will be written under 10's place and 3 will be written under 100's place. The number 28, 8 will be written under 1's place and 2 will be written under 10's place. Here 316 is the multiplicand and 28 is the multiplier. Always start the multiplication sum from 1's place. So now we will multiply 316 by 8. 8 will be multiplied by the digit at the 1's place. 8 6 are 48. 8 will be written under 1's place and 4 will be carried on 10's. Now, 8 will be multiplied by the digit at the 10's place. 8 1's are 8 plus 4 which were carried off is equal to 12. 2 will be written under 10's place and 1 will be carried on 100's. Now, 8 will be multiplied by the digit at the 100's place. 8 multiplied by 3 is equal to 24 plus 1 carried off is equal to 25. When we have multiplied 316 by 8, we got the product 2528. It will be called the first partial product. Now, we will multiply 316 by 20. As we are multiplying the multiplicand by 20, so at once place we will write the 0 first. Now, let's multiply it. 2, 6 are 12. 2 will be written under 10's place and 1 will be carried on 100's. 2 multiplied by 1 is equal to 2 plus 1 which was carried on 100. We will write 3 under 100's place. Now 2 will be multiplied by the 3. 2 3's are 6 so it will be written under 1000's place. So by multiplying 316 by 20 we have got the second partial product that is 6320. Now we will add these two partial product to get the final product. Let's add it together. 8 plus 0 is equal to 8. 2 plus 2 is equal to 4, 5 plus 3 is equal to 8, 2 plus 6 is equal to 8. The product of 316 and 28 is 8848. To understand it better, let's solve one more example. Multiply 187 by 34. Let's arrange according to its places. Then we are going to multiply it from the ones place digit. 187 will be multiplied by 4 first. 4 multiplied by the 7 which is at 1's place is equal to 28. 8 will be written under 1's place and 2 will be carried on 10's. Then 4 will be multiplied by 8. 4 8's are 32 plus 2 which was carried off is equal to 34. 4 will be written under 10's place and 3 will be carried on 100's. 4 1's are 4 plus 3 which were carried off on 100's is equal to 7. So, the first partial product of 187 multiplied by 4 is equal to 748. Now we will multiply 187 by 30. Because we are multiplying 187 by 10's place digit, so at 1's place we are going to write a 0. 3 multiplied by 7 is equal to 21. 1 will be written under 10's place and 2 will be carried off on 100's. Now 3 will be multiplied by 8. 3 8's are 24 plus 2 which were carried off is equal to 26. 6 will be written under 100's place and 2 will be carried off on 1000's. 3 multiplied by 1 is equal to 3 plus 2 which were carried off is equal to 5. So 5 we are going to write under 1000's place in 10's column. And now we are going to add these two partial product to get the final product. We always start the addition sum from 1's place. 8 plus 0 is equal to 8. 4 plus 1 is equal to 5. 7 plus 6 is equal to 13. And then 1 will be carried on 1000's. So 5 plus 1 is equal to 6. Here we have got the final product that is 6358. I hope these videos will help you in understanding these concepts. If you like my channel, do like, share and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day.